Welcome to the Logic Vision series. This is an instructional video on the sonobiometry feature. In this instruction video, you will learn about the following aspects of sonobiometry. 1. What is sonobiometry? 2. How to turn sonobiometry on or off on Logic Vision series devices. 3. How to use sonobiometry on Logic Vision series devices. 1. What is sonobiometry? Sonobiometry is a workflow tool available on the Logic Vision series systems that automatically places calipers for fetal biometry measurements, thus helping the user to perform these fetal measurements quickly. This tool can help enhance clinical workflow by reducing keystrokes to perform biometry measurements. Additionally, the user has the option to either accept or edit the measurement suggested by this tool. Currently, the sonobiometry algorithm supports automatic measurement of the following fetal measurements. Biparietal diameter, head circumference, abdominal circumference, and femur length. 2. How to turn sonobiometry on or off on Logic Vision series devices. To turn on this feature, press the Utility button on the keyboard. Then use the trackball to navigate and go to the following path. System. System Measure, Sonobiometry. Select the Sonobiometry option to activate Sonobiometry for BPD, HC, AC, and FL measurements. 3. How to use Sonobiometry on Logic Vision Series devices. Let us now go over the Sonobiometry feature on the Logic Vision Series systems, understanding the basic controls and workflow. On the patient screen, select the obstetrics application and load the OB23 presets for the related measurements to be displayed on the measurement menu. You can use sonobiometry on both frozen as well as recalled DICOM images. In this example, we will use a fetal head image to show how the tool works for BPD measurement. Once the image is frozen on the screen, press the measure key to activate the measurement menu and select the BPD measurement. The system automatically places the calipers and generates a measurement of the BPD. Once you have measured, you have three options to finalize your result. If the system-generated measurement is acceptable to you, click on Accept to confirm, and then the measurement will get transferred to the worksheet. Now we will walk through the steps to edit an auto-measurement. We will use the example of an FL measurement for editing. Once the image is on the screen, choose the FL measurement from the menu. As earlier, the tool will automatically place the calipers and obtain the measurement. To edit this measurement suggested by the tool, select the Edit option displayed on the screen. The cursor now becomes active and can be adjusted. To toggle between the active cursors, use the Cursor Select option on the top menu. Alternatively, the user also has the option of discarding the automated measurement and proceeding with a manual measurement. To do so, select the Manual option from the menu displayed. By doing this, the auto measurement clears and you can proceed with the measurement manually. The system displays a warning message if it does not find an expected anatomical structure in the image. Please proceed with a manual measurement in such cases. We hope you'll find the sonobiometry tool on your Logic Vision series devices useful and enabling. Thank you.